Hi guys, I'm back with another video. So in today's video, I'm gonna create a full makeup look using only Maybelline New York products. How exciting is that? Some products are like brand new and some I already have. So without wasting any time, let's dive into the video. First product that I'm going to use today is this. I use this in my every video. This green corrector. As I have a lot of redness on my face, so it's going to hide it. I'm just going to take it on my finger and apply on my red areas of the face. Now I'm gonna apply this. This is from PAC, it's not from Maybelline, but my under eye is a little bit dark, so I have to apply this. I don't know Maybelline produces or have any color corrector, but I'm gonna use this. I did these nails. They look so cute. I did them myself and I'm proud of it now I'm using this Maybelline 24 hour sorry it's Maybelline super stay 24 hour full coverage foundation I'm in the shade 128 warm nude I guess it's a little bit too dark for me. It's the right shade, thank God. It's not full coverage, but it's like really giving me a good coverage. I'm liking this foundation. It's really, really nice. It is blending very well. And guys, I'm really, really excited for my mystery boxes from Jeffree Star, but I haven't received them yet. For concealer today, I have this one. Maybelline Age Rewind Eraser Multi-Use Concealer. The shade that I am in is 120 light. It's a brand new. I hope this works. Where are you, bitch? Please, I cannot see you. Ew. Can you guys see that? The oil just came out. Like. Can you guys see? I haven't shaken it to be honest. What the fuck? Like. It's expired, I guess. It's a little bit light for me, but I guess I will make it work. Now it's time for some powder to set my concealer and foundation. Now I'm using this Fit Me Matte Poreless Poreless normal to oily i'm in the shade 110 porcelain powder mm. 
with this beauty blender I'm gonna dab it all over my face the powder is like really helping a lot it's really soft it's matte as it says the powder is really really nice like it's compact now it's time for contour I have this stick which is called Maybelline New York Reface Duo Stick by Face Studio. One side is this highlighter. And the other side it is contour. So let's try it on. It's a little bit orange for me, but I hope it will work. But it blends away like, where are you, bitch? Mm, it's blending away. Yeah, now, now it's visible. Maybe I'm blending it in too well or too much. So it's just like fading into, fading away. Yeah, there we go. There we have the fucking contour. The shade is very light for me. So it's blending into my skin. It's really light for me. But it's a really good stick. Now I'm gonna use the blush. Here is the blush. It's a cute and small. It's Maybelline New York Fit Me Blush in the shade 30. The shade name is Rose. These days, I'm so obsessed putting blush on myself. Like, I don't know why. Like, I just love putting blush. I want to take a bath in the fucking blush. I want to put it all over my body, all over my face. What I like to do is I'll dab a little, not too much, otherwise it will fade away. But like, if you put too much blush by mistake so you can take a beauty blender dab it it will fade a little you can also put a translucent powder or a setting powder to make it appear light now for my eyebrow I have this this is fashion brow cream pencil let's hope it works it's gray in color like dark gray back in the brows are filled i'm back in the brows are filled i'm back in the brows are filled <laughs> i love i really love that song by many mua mm. like it's not my favorite brow product but it works for me I will not recommend it to buy, but it works for me. Now, I want to do my eye look. First, I'm going to use this setting spray. It's called Maybelline New York Lasting Fix Makeup Setting Spray Matte Finish 
shake well. I want some more. For my under eye, I have used this Fit Me Loose Finishing Powder. I'm in the shade 15 Light. It's a little bit dark for me, to be honest. But still, I've taken the risk. I have a few eyeshadows from Maybelline, like this one which is a nude one I have this which has a little bit colors in it and this one the glitter in this is really amazing I'm thinking to do both the eyes different these shades have no name so I'm diving into this one I hope it's good, good eyeshadow. There is a fallout like every eyeshadow does. Now I will take the shade. I'm gonna take this one. Now I'm going to apply this. This is the darkest brown in this palette. It's not that much pigmented and like Morphe obviously. Like in drugstore I use NYX NYX. That's also really amazing. But like I'm not a fan of this palette. I'm like I want to put this shade on my outer corner I think it's pigmented it's really intense no it's not it's not pigmented now I'm gonna apply this glitter I hope it looks good. I'm just like picking a random color and putting on my eyes. It's really dark. No, it's way too dark. I'm not gonna apply that. I'm going to apply this and this one. It's not shiny, like it's looking nice, but Now I'm taking this one and mixing a little bit of this. Oh my god, I have ruined the whole palette. Now I'm gonna do this eye. I'm gonna put these shades on this eye, like a color follow. Sorry, I forgot to do my other eye. I'm taking this shade right here. Now I'm gonna take this green shade. Now for my inner corner, I'm gonna apply this shade. Now I'm going to do this side. Wish me luck. This palette is called the City Mini Palette by Maybelline New York. These have names like the one that I used here is called Urban Jungle. And this one is called Graffiti Pop. Let's try this shade. I'm taking this shade I'm 
sorry guys my mobile just died so I did this eye with this palette first I used this shade and then this shade then on my outer corner this not this one on my outer corner and on that lid I use this shade but this shade keeps fading away like it's like fading away and for my inner corner I use this shade it's not the palette is not that bad as I expected it to be but it's really really nice it's not pigmented but you can make it work now I'm gonna just put on a liner I have this one it's called Maybelline New York line tattoo high impact liner I have two mascaras. I'm gonna use this on this side and this one on this side. This is a brand new. It's called Maybelline New York the Hyper Curl Waterproof Mascara. The water in my eye is ruining the eye look. I can't help it. You know, without lashes, the eye will not look good. So, after applying the scar, I will put some lashes on. This one is really nice scar. They do all the things. Chef drama water. It has a different one. This one more like it was applied so smoothly. I like the one I guess. Now I'm gonna apply lashes and I will be right back. I'm back. The lashes lift the eye look. Like it's amazing. It do a really great thing. Now I'm gonna apply this highlighter. It's called Maybelline Master Chrome by Face Studio Metallic Highlighter. Eliminator, sorry, it's in the shade 100 Molten Gold. Here I'm gonna apply another highlighter. This one is a little peachy highlighter. It's also called Master Chrome. It's in the shade 50 Rose Gold. For lips today, I have these four Maybelline lipsticks. I have more, but for the look, now I'm not going to do half lips. I'm going to apply a nice nude shade. I'm going to apply 
and this one first which is 660 touch of spice it smells like chocolate now I'm applying a little bit darker which is 696 burgundy blush it's I guess way too dark let's see At last, I want to spray this again. And the look is finished. So, let me give you my reviews. The lipstick. I'm fan. Like the lipstick I used it for the first time. I never used it. And I'm really really liking like I have mixed two. You can wear that individually without mixing. And the highlighter. It's amazing you all. It's amazing. Like amazing. the eyeshadow it's like not pigmented like it's a little bit pigmented not that much like morphe and all but of course it's a drugstore but it's really nice the eyeshadow palette for me like this one was a flop I this one's a little bit nice this one and that another one that I have this one is graffiti pop this one I like this eye to be honest I like this eye more and liner I like that pot liner here it is I like this one rather than the brush one the foundation was nice concealer I guess it was expired or something I didn't sh shake it well before using so like the water came first and then the concealer came the compact it was amazing. The eyebrow pencil was like, I was not like amazed by it. I love the Anastasia Pome, but like, this one was not for me. So, this was all for the video. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment, share. And subscribe to my channel, please.